So today I'm filming an un unboxing of a Cyborg version 5 gaming keyboard. So let's get my knife and do that side. And that side. So I decided to get this keyboard because all I've been using at the moment is the Mac keyboard, which is too thin. I don't like the keys. So I decided to get a gaming keyboard because the keys are a lot thicker. And I like this keyboard, so a bit of the air. So, on the outside of the box, you can see the keyboard itself. Anti ghosting. Fit gaming key areas, so the WASD keys, the arrow keys, fully pro programmable function keys, red backlighting so you can see it in the dark, on the back just go over the same things, so by opening this tab can hopefully get into it. Okay. So there we go. So what do we get in the box? So that is the wrist guard. Plastic but It'll be plenty enough to keep my wrists safe and uh, not hurting when I'm using the keyboard. So here is the Cyborg V5. So included in the box you get technical support and warranty information, user manual and the Cyborg product information, product guide. So you can see Keyboard, mice, and mats. Same on the other side, and the joystick at the end. So, let's actually get into this keyboard. When I took the, the keyboard out of the box, I was surprised how heavy it is. It is actually made out of plastic, but it is it's a very firm plastic strong so it will it won't snap easily on the back you've got two little stands so you can have the keyboard at an angle so it's a very it's like sort of the covering of the keys is is plastic but is grippy so you won't slip off uh, when you're in game you all the function keys so then you've got a light key, uh, volume, directional, so yes, I'll plug this in and then get back to you and show you what the red bat lighting is like. So as you can see there, I plugged it in and you can, even though it's daytime, you can still tell that the red bat lighting is on. So if you hit this button over here, it dims it so it's not as bright and then you can turn it off altogether. So even in the day you can still see the keys well, it's white on black, but it is a clear black, a uh, clear white, sorry. So the, all the volume keys work, you can hear that, the Mac keyboard, the Mac sound, and you can hit it, get, hit it off all together. Caps lock, shows there, scroll lock, well because it's plugged into the Mac, it's technically hasn't got scroll lock or number lock. So those ones aren't working, but on a PC those those two will light up when you hit number lock and when you hit scroll lock. So yeah, I'll put the wrist guard in. So this goes in here somehow. I'll show you once I've done, I'll come back once I finish putting this in.
So there we go. Just had to clip the two uh, clips in. So you can have it out or you can have it pushed in depending on how long your wrists are and where you want it. So yeah, overall this looks like a good keyboard. I will do a review in the next week or so about how I find it, would I recommend it. So yeah, thanks for watching. Remember to like the video and subscribe to get that video and all the other videos I will be doing soon about tech, iPhone 5s and anything in the tech world.